Art for art. Right. Oh! oh. Sean O'Malley versus Jose Quinones. Man, this is a really good fight, man. Sean is coming back two year layoff versus Jose Quinones. He's a veteran. You know, he's game, man. This boy came to fight, man. He was upset. He's like, he felt like he was being overlooked and he was coming to fight. You know, O'Malley over here, it's been like two years. That boy came. He's just like, I just want to feel it. Deep breaths, arms out. Let's go, baby. So, what really happened in this fight? Let's get it. So straight from the jump, you could tell Jose's game plan, pressure. He's pushing him back the whole time while he's just going backwards. Right here, almost tagged him, but he was able to move right out of the range of that punch. But just see O'Malley backwards on his wheel, moving, you know, using his feet work and just trying to get out the way, but then countered. Leg kick, push kicks, front kick, spinning back kick. Sit your ass down. No, no, no. Right now, sit your ass down, though, boy. That's too much pressure. O'Malley was able to counter appropriately with his kicks, push kicks. And right here, a beautiful overhand right that cracked Jose. But you know, Jose's tough. He's durable. He was able to eat it. Only mistake O'Malley made in this fight, naked leg. Jose countered right there, got tagged. He threw a naked leg kick, then set it up, and Jose was able to counter. That was the only real success he had in the fight, but he was right back to pressure on O'Malley. But you can't do that to O'Malley. He's gonna snipe your ass. Once again, he pressure and tried his right. He got countered by O'Malley right there. Perfect right counter. He tried his right cross, got countered, dropped to the ground. O'Malley followed up with a head kick. Look at his head kick. He blocked it partially, but a little bit got through. That's O'Malley, man. That's a baseball bat. If you swing across your head, you stun a little bit. He's going to finish you. 